Click the link to MTG Burgeoning's Introduction to Plane Chase in the description below. There are some planes in Plane Chase that grant powerful static abilities to all players. From ramping mana, producing creature tokens, copying spells and drawing cards, to enhancing creatures, graveyard recursion, fixing mana, and incentivizing combat. Some planes have the potential of dramatically altering the landscape of the game. As a way to hedge against this opponent's philanthropy, the chaos abilities of these planes motivate their inclusion into planar decks by providing a warmer self-embrace. With the idea of hugging the group, and yourself a little bit more, keep in mind, Sokenzan could be added to most planar decks. All creatures get plus one, plus one, and haste. This plane should inspire and incentivize a lot of combat when it's revealed from the planar deck. Whenever you roll chaos, untap all creatures that attacked this turn. After this phase, there is an additional combat phase, followed by an additional main phase. This relentless assault feature could be used as a potential win condition, either through combat damage, lethal commander damage, or from a hasty infector like Blightsteel Colossus. Truga Jungle could be added to most planar decks. All lands have tap add one mana of any color. Each land on the battlefield is a mana confluence without the penalty of losing one life each time it's tapped for mana. Whenever you roll Chaos, reveal the top three cards of your library. Put all land cards revealed this way into your hand, and the rest on the bottom of your library in any order. Truga Jungle wants to fix mana and put lands into your hand. More mana, more mana, more mana. Oh, Naki Catacomb could be added to most planar decks. All creatures are black and have Death Touch. This nullifies Doomblade and other non-black spot removal spells and incentivizes you to fill the 99 of your EDH deck with creatures that have protection from black, as combat becomes your playground. Whenever you roll Chaos, creatures you control get plus one, plus zero, and gain first strike until end of turn. A temporary power boost is meh, but First Strike and Death Touch allows your creatures to enter into combat and deal First Strike death-touching damage to blockers, killing them instantly before your own creatures are dealt combat damage. 